Jake always interrupts me in meetings. I don't remember the last time I was able to finish a sentence without his two cents. Nala constantly lashes out and talks down to me. Just because she's been here longer doesn't mean she should get to make all the decisions. Just a few weeks ago, Jake and Nala were productively working on a high-priority data project, and as the deadline looms, Kate needs to get to the bottom of this. As their supervisor, Kate needs to cut through the noise and emotions of their conflict and determine what's really going on. Assessing and understanding the source of conflict can point the way to possible solutions. The four most common sources of conflict are task, or what work will be done, including plans, ideas, projects, or goals. Process, or how to get the work done, including methods for making decisions and the steps and people involved. Status, disagreement about who is in charge or deserves credit for the work, or relationship, which is interpersonal conflict involving anger and hurt feelings. Let's look at our example more closely. Jake and Nala interrupt and undermine each other, which seems like a relationship conflict. But if Kate dug deeper, she would see that it all started with Jake becoming defensive when Nala criticized his idea for how to manage data. That's what this conflict is really about. They both had a similar goal, efficiently managing data, but disagreed on the process. And the next thing we know, Nala calls Jake's method outdated and the relationship conflict spirals. Keep in mind that it's rare for conflict to fit into just one source. There may be multiple things going on, or it may start as one and move into another, like in our example. Determining the source of conflict will help you prioritize the next steps so that you can manage conflict more effectively. In our example, the source of Jake and Nala's disagreement is the process, so Kate needs to help them find common ground. However, before they can have a productive conversation, Kate needs to help them manage their emotions, which is a key skill in handling a relationship conflict. So the next time you face a conflict, take a step back and determine the source of the conflict, as this will help you handle the situation even more effectively.